Hello everybody, this is Jeff with the Trek Planner. I wanted to show you the account page and also the Trek challenges. So first, the account page. So first, you need to come to the trekplanner.com and up at the top you'll see a little person right here. And since I'm already logged in, uh, you'll have this little logout button as another option. But uh, let's go to account page. Okay, and this will uh, pop up here, the same menu bars up top. Then you'll have your personal information. Uh, looks like I'm logged in as the admin, of course. It's, it's my own website. Uh, I've been a member since 2013. Uh, my current rank is Sightseer, uh, which is the lowest rank. And I have zero treks verified out of 628. So uh, the ranks have to do with uh, the treks verified here. And the treks verified have to do with the uh, trek challenges. Uh, let's go over the adventure journal first. So as uh, by default, this will appear first. And this is where you keep track of your to-do lists and your I've done this lists, or I've done it, and also your read later lists. So right now I don't have anything on these things right here. Um, and I have two items here. Uh, let's add some more. So let's go, for example, to Timber Creek. Uh, this trail is in Zion. And I'll go up to the top here. Uh, and let's say you open it up and you just don't have time to read it all but want to uh, read it later. So on the left-hand sidebar, you can uh, save for later. So click that. Okay, looks good. And let's go to another trek. Um, this is Cliff Palace in Colorado. And so uh, let's say you're going through this, and this just looks really fun to you. And so you'll add it to your to-do list. So I'll click that. And okay, looks like it's added. All right, so... Let's go check my account page. So click this person up top, and it'll load my account page here. Okay, great. So it looks like Cliff Palace was added, and my read later list, great. So this is a Timber Creek there. Uh, now let's talk about these lists. So I've done it verified. So you can either just add something. So let's say you go back to, uh, let's, actually let's pull up a new one, uh, Bloods Lake. And let's say you are coming down through here, and you're just reading the article and you come across the trek challenge so let, uh, let's see the trek challenge is prove that you have been to bloods lake take a selfie or a picture of yourself with bloods lake in the background so let's say i've actually been to bloods lake but i don't have this little challenge i don't have a selfie of myself with a lake or pictures of me um, but i want to keep it on my list so i can keep track of it so you can do the have you done this over here on the left sidebar and i'll just click yes and then scroll up to the top to my account again and there it is under I've done this. Uh, but let's say, for example, there's another one. Um, so this one here, uh, Jenny Lake. So let's say I'm reading this one and I'm scrolling down, scrolling down until I see uh, the Trek Challenge photo. Uh, prove that you have been to Jenny Lake Scenic Drive. Take a selfie or picture of yourself with Jenny Lake. And I know I have that one. Uh, so I'm going to click yes, verify my photo. And then you upload the photo. Here's some more instructions. Uh, I'm going to find Jenny. Okay, Jenny Lake. going to submit it. And then uh, the picture gets submitted to one of the Trek Planner admin uh, to review. So um, we wait for probably a day or so. And when it's verified, you're going to either get two, uh, one of two emails. Uh, you're either going to get one of these, it looks like this, your picture was verified, great work, you know, good job. Uh, then if it wasn't verified, so let, or if it wasn't verified that you actually did that challenge, so let's say I just sub submitted a random picture of a, a mountain or something for the Jenny Lake challenge, and obviously that wasn't the challenge, so you'll get one of these that says, sorry, your picture was not verified. Uh, so yeah, so you're going to either get one of these two emails sent to you. And I will be waiting for, like I said, a day or two. And uh, once I get the email, go up to your account. So it looks like I got an email already and it was approved, or it was verified, sorry. So my account. And oh, great. Yeah, it looks, uh, you have one Trex verified of 628. So I got a long way to go, but that's all right. Uh, scroll down here and oh cool there it is yeah so uh jenny lake scenic drive grand teton sorry i'm not surprised that it's there i'm just it's just really cool to see this all work together uh so you can see my picture that i uploaded yep that's me in front of uh jenny lake in the uh, grand teton mountains so great i have one down 
Uh, and if you want to find out about uh, ranks, so you go to help over here on your um, uh, user menu and scroll down to, I believe, the bottom. There it is. Uh, Trek Planner user ranks. So zero to five is Sightseer. So like I said, that's the, the bottom of the ranks, which is fine. Uh, there's a lot to work up to. Uh, six to ten is Traveler, then Scout and Explorer, all the way down to Trek Wizard. So uh, there's lots of lots of fun things in store for all these. Um, the more you rank up, the better the prizes will be um, for you, um, and you're just randomly entered in for all these prizes. But Trek Challenges are just something fun to do. Um, if you have any more questions, on your Help tab, there's also this page right here. And it'll give you all the information you could ever possibly want uh, to know about uh, Trek Challenges. So basically, we're just verifying that you actually did the Trek Challenge, and that's all that means. Um, now I will go over uh, something else. As a member, so your profile, this is where you change your photo and your password and things. Uh, your adventure journal, that's what all your to-do lists are. Uh, the itinerary builder, I'll go over in another video. Uh, insider treks. So as a trek planner insider, you have access to uh, our secret and private and hidden uh, GPS coordinates, our trail maps, and other fun things. So here's a list of all of them. You can sort by state up here. You can see how many we have per state and sort them by uh, you know alphabetical or newest and oldest uh, date is published. Um, so when you come to these, you just click on the link and then go through the, uh, the post and you'll see a big uh, Trek Planner uh, for uh, Trek Planner Insider members only. So that's how you know that's uh, where that information is located. Uh, also, Trek Tokens is up here. So Trek Tokens have to relate with token challenges. So uh, Trek challenges are kind of the easier things to do. Um, I mean, you can do them with your friends and family. Uh, you can do these too with your family and friends, but they're a little bit harder. So right now we have two uh, token challenges available. Um, this one right here is the race to Adams Water, sorry, Adams Canyon Upper Waterfall. Uh, link to the trek, and it looks like only eight tokens are available. Uh, these are actual plastic number tokens that we will send to you um, if you complete this challenge. So eight people, um, those eight people who complete this challenge uh, first will be given a token no matter what, and those eight people will be entered in to win this Marmot Tungsten two-person tent. Um, and so the challenge is to hike from the parking lot of Adams Canyon uh, to the upper waterfall in an hour and 15 minutes. So that's kind of a, uh, if you're walking really fast, you could do that. Um, so it's, it's kind of a, a challenge. Uh, you need to send your map that has all of your GPX, sorry, GPS information on it and send it to uh, this email address. Um, and same with uh, the primitive trail to Dark Angel, kind of the same kind of a thing. Um, we just need a way to kind of make sure that you actually did the the challenge, so that's why we're asking for a trail map or whatever we ask inside of this. Uh, this challenge is for a GSI backpacker cook set, so I have this one, it's a really cool cook set. Uh, none of this stuff is sponsored, this is all just from us, um, but yeah, these are just really fun ways to, to do, a little simple, uh, do something extra uh, while you're out there. This one you also get a really cool token, and you just keep that forever and collect them. Uh, next up is contests and prizes. And as you can see, uh, the different drawings for the different ranks. So if you're a sightseer, you will be automatically entered in to win um, small camping items, dehydrated camping food, or other small things. Uh, if you're a traveler, you will be automatically entered in for water bottles, beanies, hats, and uh, you can see so forth. The prizes get better, better. Tents, hammocks, down coats, high-end coolers, rock climbing equipment, gift cards, <laughs> high-end jackets, solar panel systems, entire outfits, gift cards, pay trips, and tons of cool stuff. And here's some um, rules and things. But this is all up at your top menu. Um, and subscriptions, this is the last thing I'll go over. Uh, this is where you can see your uh, subscription. And since, of course, I'm the admin, my subscription never ends. But you'll see the expiration date here. Um, keep in mind, we do have periodic coupons and, and promotions and things, um, so um, just just kind of uh, pay attention to our Facebook and Instagram uh, feeds for uh, more information. But this is the list of all of our uh, memberships right here. So that's uh, the account page and also the Trek challenges. If you have any questions, please let us know and send us an email. Thank you.